Hi, I'm Mrs. Spaeth from the second grade Painesville Elementary and today we're going to be talking about the life cycle project that the second graders do every year in science. The students were assigned either an animal or plant that they could learn about research and then present in a format that they chose that would show their learning. So today I'm hoping that you'll get a good chance to meet some of our second graders talking about their life cycles. Enjoy! Hello, my name is Tyler. This is my life cycle of a spider. It is very fun to look at because you could see it molting adults and it is usually the egg sac is their children inside so it's nice to look at in the hall and there's little spiders. We added details like the cobwebs and then we add this on here, my name, and then I have this around here so you can see all about it. So this is my spider life cycle. My name is Lydia Schmitz and my life cycle is of a giraffe. They give birth standing up and their average height is like six feet and birth weight is around 150 to 200 pounds. Calves rely on their mother's milk for nine to 12 months. Giraffes grow to be 15 to 19 feet and weight from 1,500 to 2,000 and 500 My name's Olivia, and I'm, I did a life cycle of a cheetah. Um, did you know cheetahs don't make any sound? They don't even have a swimming bone. My name is Olivia. I made a project that was a cat, kitty, and I learned that Cats have nine lives. Hi, my name is Jocelyn, and I chose a frog life cycle. I wanted to learn so much about a frog, so my mom went online and found a life cycle of a frog, and so I chose that. Frog spawn, tadpoles, water pond, froglet, a frog. That's what my like, my life cycle is all about. I'm Bryce, and I learned polar bears only have three stages, but more than one, and they usually eat. They usually try to catch their food, and they like to play with each other, and. When they have babies, they're not, mm, there's only the mom, not the dad. My name's Riley. What I liked about the poster was the cute pictures. This was one of my favorite pictures. It's one of the pandas on the first stages. First, the panda starts out as a little red creature, and then it starts to get some fur, and then it goes to a cute little panda. Back to you in the studio!